All right, y'all, I'm here in my MetaMask wallet, and I'm going to show you how to um, add in the Etherlite mainnet to your MetaMask. Um, the only thing that MetaMask offers are these networks that are in color right here. So if you have Binance or Etherlite, you need to add in the network automatically. You need to manually do it. So what you do is click over on the top left menu, go to Settings. Scroll down to Networks, and then click Add Network. When you click Add Network, it's going to open up to this page, except these will be blank. This information will be in the description below, so you just copy-paste it just like it shows here, and then you'll click Save, and then it will add it in. Same thing if you want to do the Binance Smart Chain. You get this information, plug it in, and it will add the network to your wallet. And what this means is, if you click on the top where it says Wallet, if you're purchasing something with Ethereum, you need to be the Ethereum main network. If you're purchasing BNB, you need to be in the BNB network. So it knows what coin to pull from what wallet. So I added in the Etherlite main network. You can also do this through the etherlite.org if you go through the browser. Um, I have another video for that one, but this is just to manually do it. Now, when you earn through referrals or you buy, you will get them within this wallet, but you need to have a place for it. See the little red circle here? I needed to add that wallet address in. So what I did is I clicked add tokens, went to custom token, and I put the token address. I already have the contract address there. You can normally get this from like uh, Etherscan or BSC scan as such. Um, so you get the token address and you add the token into the wallet and it will automatically fill out this token symbol and the decimals. If it doesn't, you can get that from, you know, Etherscan or BSC scan um, when you're doing this for other tokens. But this information will be in the description below. So click add token and then it's going to it's going to create this little spot here for me. So anytime you earn or when you buy them, you need to make sure that you come back, that you're in the Etherlite main network, not in Ethereum, and it'll be right here. If you want to go back and use your Etherlite to purchase things, you go back, back and forth, Etherlite, Ethereum main, so on and so forth. If you found value in this, please like and subscribe. I do a lot of tutorials with the basics of crypto, and I have a crypto mentorship group if you're looking for some help to fast track through all of these obstacles that can sometimes be daunting when you're trying to find your way. Um, just comment below. We can connect. I can get you more info or check out my channel and you'll find more of the basic crypto tutorials.